The Gina and Maddie podcast. Gina Jeffries, uh, hanging out with celebs. It's kind of just what you do, isn't it? Oh, pretty much. Pretty much these days. We, <laughs> you missed such a good night. We had our 20th birthday for Star a couple of Fridays ago. No, the FOMO and, was real. I saw all the socials. Oh, Producer Loz just sending me photos. Your who's, was, your who's who of the Central Coast were there, Maddie? <laughs> yeah, I saw Nathan Foley was there. Yeah. <laughs> he was. Yeah. <laughs> So fun. Cointa Waters, beautiful venue. Food was amazing. Wine and beer, everything was flowing. We had the best time ever. We did miss you a lot. But did, I... did, did Chain with the Wire pretend to be me? Because yeah. that was kind of the, that was <laughs> yeah. floated around for a little bit. I was like, mate, you can easily just pretend to be me. Like, you just have to get up there, be, be a little bit more inappropriate than what you normally are. And then, like, everyone's like, oh, that's Maddie, right? Okay. Well, they wouldn't know. That, yeah, so yeah. Shane, Shane with the Wire jumped up with me and helped me host it. But before mm-hmm. that, I got to go backstage because Samantha Jade was the special guest and she is gorgeous and she sang with uh, three boys that she met on, uh, is it Australia's Got Talent? What was she? X Factor. Voice? I don't know. They were (laughs) three part harmony and they sort of did like acoustic versions of super cool pop. Oh, it was really, really good. But I got to sit down and chat with her right before she went on and she is so lovely. Here's what she had to say. Hey, we are here for Star's 20th birthday. Can you believe it? And we are so lucky. We've got the beautiful one and only Samantha Jade here with us tonight. Hello. Hello. Happy birthday. Oh, thank you. We don't look... We, I'm day over 10. No, okay. it's very true. Very true. I was just listening to your sound check. You sound incredible. We're so excited to hear you play tonight. Oh, we're excited to be here. It's so nice to be able to sing acoustic. It's my favourite. I love it. Yeah. I love it. So your band is amazing. You've got like yes. one guitarist and three one backing One guitarist, vocalists. two backing um, vocalists. And I actually met them when I did X Factor. They oh. were on the show too, oh. so we've known each other for years. Yes, yeah. of course. Yeah. They were in a boy band called Fortunate. Now you're on another TV show. And, uh, yes. Dancing with the Stars. Yes. Have you been tra- in training? Oh, yes, I've been training. Is it so hard? I cannot tell you how sore my body is. Like, uh, <laughs> I, there's muscles I didn't even know really? I had. Really? <laughs> yeah. But you can already dance. Could you already dance a little bit? Not ballroom and Latin. And like, I thought that going in, I was like, oh, I'll be fine. I dance in my shows. Totally different. Really? Like picking up steps, yeah, you know, because yeah. I'm used to picking up steps. Yeah. But they're, it's so different. It's a different world. Even my dancers were like, oh, yeah, no, it's a totally different world. I reckon you're going to go really well. Oh, I it. hope so. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Oh, you're so natural. Thank I will you. be rooting for you for oh, sure. Who thanks. else is in it? Uh, Nikki Osborne, who's yeah. hilarious. Um, Julie Goodwin from Julie the Central Coast. Julie Goodwin, She's, who I love. Isn't she lovely? One of the nicest people she I've ever really met. She really is. And genuinely yeah, really nice. Yeah, she really is. Um, Nova, Nova Paris, who's an amazing yeah, athlete. Yeah, she's uh, gorgeous. Olympic uh, medalist. Yeah. Uh, who else is in there? Hayden, who's a chef. Who I was like, um, oh. where is the food? Every time he came yes. to set, never brought me anything. Um, is there anyone who absolutely can't dance? That it's just like really, really hard for them. No, oh. I don't reckon. Really? I don't reckon. I reckon everyone. Do you know what? We're so lucky because we have the most amazing dance partners yeah, who yeah. who literally teach us and train us Make and it easier. and they well they spend so much time with us so all yeah. of us all of us can can give it a red hot go I'll say that I'm much. one of those people you know when you go to aerobics yeah yeah <laughs> and they show you the first move and then they turn around and suddenly the backs the front yeah and you're like oh hang on so that's like what happens when they take you away from the mirror I know and then right? I'm like you wait, can't see I can't them see anymore myself. I can't remember yeah, it. yeah. <laughs> oh we can't wait to see you and thank you for being here for a 20th birthday of course thanks for having me Oh. There she is, backstage at Star 104.5's 20th birthday with Gina Jeffrey. Samantha Jade, she totally knew someone that can't dance. Mm. She just didn't want to say it. She's too <laughs> nice. She didn't want to rag on anyone. Yeah, I thought she, that would be me if I went on that. I'm the world's worst dancer. No, you're not saying oh. no, you're not. Oh, no, is that what I was meant to jo- jump in? Oh, okay, no, no, it's fine. Okay, let's move on. Uh- <laughs> well, we also got to play a fun game with Samantha Jade. She what was, did you play? Well, you and I have played it, Maddie, the the whisper game where, you know, you put on headphones and you turn up ACDC or something very, very loud and then the other person whispers and you have to guess what it is they're saying. And I'll tell you what, it was hard because we don't really know each other, whereas you and I, me guessing you, yeah. I, I watch you talk every morning so I can yeah. kind of – it's a – Tiny, tiny bit easier, but someone who you just met, bit tricky. Okay, let's see how it went. Samantha Jade doing the Whisper Challenge. Gina's my favourite. Cheese? (laughs) Cheese? (laughs) Cheese buffet. Gina's my (laughs) favourite. I know you're not saying cheese buffet. (laughs) Cheese buffet? (laughs) Gina's my favourite. Cheese and (laughs) Mavis. 
No, no cheese. Not cheese. Okay. Gina's my favourite. Not cheese. Not cheese. One more. Gina's my favourite. She's my favourite. Oh. The second bit's right. She's my favourite? Nearly, nearly. First bit. Gina's my favourite. Cheese is my favourite. <laughs> she is my favourite. Gina's my favourite. Gina's my favourite. <laughs> Gina's my favourite. Gina's my favourite. Yeah! <laughs> First try. How good is that? Oh, she uh, really you... likes the cheese, doesn't she? <laughs> Gina and Maddie. We had the 20th birthday party mm. for Star 104.5 while I was off. Yeah, it was so fun. It was so it was lots of lovely people, lots of everything about it was fabulous. But I walked around the room and I was asking if anyone thought they could guess what was the number one song for the last 20 years, the most played song on Star. And everyone had a good go. They were, but do have a listen to what they thought? Do you know what the most played song of the last 20 years on Star FM was? It's going to be like Happy for a Williams, right? Horses by Daryl Braithwaite. <laughs> I'm going to say Thriller by Michael Jackson. Something Ed Sheeran? I'm going to go A Team by Ed Sheeran. I think it's Ed Sheeran. I might go Ed Sheeran. I reckon it's Pink. Gracie Glass Pink. Lady Gaga. Riptide by Vance Joy, because that's been going along a long time. You know? Oh my God! That could be it. Yeah. It's going to be Taylor Swift, Shake It Off. Some kind of Taylor Swift song. Well, Taylor Swift's pretty popular at the moment. I mean, she's pretty. she's been around for a long time. Is that Taylor? Which, which song would you choose? No, any any of them. That's what people say. <laughs> Maybe this one? Yeah, this one. That's what people say. Now, I did see that on our socials at Star1045 and at Gina and Maddie. Give us a follow, go and do it. Um, <laughs> and I well, I think it could be a Pink song. I don't know, but Pink has been huge. She's mm. one of the biggest artists in this country. She's been around for 20 years. I'm going to throw out, I'm not going to pick a song. I'm going to sit on a fence and just say it's Pink. <laughs> That's my guess. I reckon that, that was a good guess too because when you really think about it, you know, Taylor Swift, lots of people said her, but she's more recently, you know. Yeah. So you got to go 20 years. Ed Sheeran probably is more recent than the, the 20 years as well. So it was mm. a bit of a thinker. I was quite surprised actually at number three was this. So baby, pull me closer in the back oh. Yeah. You love it. That's the chain smokers and Halsey. Closer. Number three. Number that three. Is the third most played song ever. On on Star. Yes. Wow. Okay. Coming in at number, number, two. Two number two was this one. What you made me do. Oh, Mind blown, Maddie. What? Okay. That must have been played that. a lot because that's quite new, isn't it? Must have played the pants off that one. A bit of Sam Smith. <laughs> and All this, right. This... Let, me, let me do a drum roll. Let me do a drum roll. Okay. Hang on, let me do a drum roll. Okay, here we go. Give it a sec. Here we go. In the number the one position. Number one song played in the last 20 years on Star 104.5 is... Like to love me, do what I want when I'm gone. <laughs> Girls, Maroon 5. Yes. Girls like you. Yeah, yeah, I just call yeah. it girls. <laughs> so no one. No one, no one right. was right. No, no one at the party. No, no. There it is. Wow. <laughs> Gosh, got to play some more pink, I think. <laughs> the Gina and Maddie podcast. For more great comedy shows like this, head to novapodcast.com.au.